Bitches like bitches with hair perm. Now I like it natural, actual, factual, naps and shit. Bougie still do ratchet shit. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's with Nanda here, aka Low. What's good? What's popping, y'all? Thanks for tuning in for another video from moi. I know. <laughs> y'all wanna see me? I'm just kidding. But, anyways, so as you guys can tell by the thumbnail, we are gonna be trying a new makeup line by Merit. They sent me this. Oh, They sent me this product and um, they sent me this little box of some goodies of their makeup line. Less is more. They are more catered, catered to environmental friendly stuff. They want to make it healthy for your skin, your um, your hair. Well, no, your skin, your body, and the planet all in general because they don't make any hair products. So you saying hair. Um, so they did launch two 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 okay on some of their new lip products and stuff like that and um various of shades so they want to showcase the new glow up okay so with that being said we'll be trying a couple different products um they the owner of it she thought about this about three years ago so she came with the idea and it's also in sephora so if you guys are definitely interested in shopping and get some of the products i will leave links in the description and um you can definitely go to sephora if you don't want to shop online but i prefer to shop online you know what i'm saying support your girl support your girl shop online is easier stay covid free stay germ free you know what it is you know what i'm saying so let's get into what i got in this box all right so guys this is how the box came unless it's more at mary if you guys want to check their instagram out i'll put it on the screen um uh, this box is made from 100 percent post consumer waste and it's 100 percent recyclable like i tell you guys they are they're all for the environment and everything like that everything is healthy and safe so that's a good thing i have sensitive skin so that's right up my alley so they also gave you this little card right here um they tell you they have the signature lip and what it's about is lightweight, durable, satin, clean, cruelty free, and vegan. So for my vegans, like I said, it's definitely sensitive skin worthy. You guys know I suffer from dermatitis, cerebritis on my face. I will link a video above. From time to time, it will flare up. So I use try to be very, very careful on what I put on my face. So with this being cruelty free, very vegan, very environmentally friendly, I thought this would be a great product to try for you guys. It came in a super cute purse. I really like it. Corduroy, honey. I like that. I like that. So I could definitely put my makeup in here if I'm traveling, for sure. Um, these are some of the products that I have, but I'll also be showing you guys um, individually when I put them on my face. But this is the blush. This is a lippy. This is a foundation stick. This is our mascara. Another balm lippy. And this is another lippy as well, more like a lipstick like the other one. And this is a highlighter stick. So we are about to get into this little face so if you guys are interested in seeing how these products apply on my melanin skin and see how it works and see my thoughts and opinions and see how i apply my makeup real quick then make sure you keep watching this okay y'all so i am just gonna start with some primer like i said i won't be showing you guys in detail what i'm using but if you are interested i could definitely put that in the description box as well but um first of all hold on let me pin back the bob okay it's not stiffiana at all I flat ironed my hair, so that's what it's giving. It's not giving flat, flat, but it's giving something. You know what I'm saying? Um, cover up some of these little dark spots from underneath my eyes. So I do um, conceal just a little bit. So that's what I'm going to do. So guys, next I'll be applying is my blush. This is by Merit as well. This is how it looks. It's so cute. It's very moisturizing. And it is the Raspberry Barrette. So I just went ahead and put my blush on first. Cause I was like, this is a cream blush. I've really never used cream blush. I've always used, um, powder so I'm just gonna blend this in real quick and I'm also going to use the highlighter that's also by Merit the color that I wanted was actually sold out so I just got the second one that they do have available this is Canva I use it a little bit as you guys can tell 
but it's a really pretty let me wipe this off so this is what it looks like i used it a little bit already but it's a really really pretty um like pearlish color so i'm just gonna put a little bit on top of the cheeks a little bit for a little highlight Ooh, seems like a lot child but it ain't it's gonna blend right on out Okay, and so guys, what we're going to be using is the Merit Foundation Stick. This one is in Cocoa. That is the color right there. All right, super pretty. I like the packaging. Everything is so sleek, clean, nice. So I'm just going to put this on my face and blend this all the way out. All right, this is what it's looking like, y'all. It's very light, very airy, very simple. It's a biddable foundation, so you guys can also keep on applying more if you would like. I think there is maybe one to two shades. I'll try to find it and put it on the screen. That is for melanin skin. Very, very limited. But I can say at least this one works out for me. They can probably do a little bit better on that because, you know, we like to... We have variety you know what i'm saying and for the fact it's clean i think we should definitely have variety but i like it okay this is what we looking like y'all it's not too much like i said this is very light definitely good for the sensitive skin girls and the girls that just like to put on a little something not so this is what my skin's looking like nice soft airy i'm cool with it we're just gonna conceal under the eyes and while i'm waiting for that to dry you guys i am going to do my brows Okay, y'all, so I'm going to set under my eyes with some powder. Sometimes I like to go back in with a little bit of this um, blush and just touch up where it might have went away a little. And that's why I like this blush because I can just tap it on in, child. All right, y'all. So I usually just kind of finish off with a little finishing powder. Okay, y'all, so this is how my face is looking. Nothing too much, very simple. And then I'm just gonna set my face a little. Okay, y'all, so my face is looking pretty clean, so easy and simple. I am now going to try out their mascara. Super cute. This one is in, it's perfect black. It's a lengthening mascara, so look at the packaging. Oh, I got all the stuff on it, but it's super cute. Sleek, gives me L'Oreal. Like, it's cute. And then I just put a little bit on. So... This is how the mascara is looking, y'all. Okay, okay, okay. And I'm gonna get some more of this highlighter and just kind of like highlight my high points of my cheek again. I'll do a little down the bridge of my nose, at the tip of my nose. And I will do my nose with my finger. And then I'll just go in with my beauty blender and get my sides. Okay. 
So what I'm gonna do is use my brown pencil and line my lips. And so I have two lippies um, plus a gloss and uh, they both look like this. This one is the 1990. Super pretty, it's very neutral. I like a neutral. And this one is Slip. And they have a cute logo on there. So, I might show you guys how it looks. Both of them look on my skin. So this one is going to be Slip. So this is how the Slip looks on my lips. Very neutral, you can't even tell it's there. I'm going to put the gloss on top and see if it gives an extra color. It just heightens it just a little. But it's giving. Okay, so let's try the other one. Let's try 1990. This is 1990. This is very, like, very nude. I don't know why I picked, I feel like I picked the, it looked different on the camera, but, on the internet, but, I would have to put another color in the middle to brighten it up, but this is how it looks without anything. Let me see if I put a little something in the middle. It does give a cute ombre when I get something in the middle. I really like that. Okay, this is super, super cute. So guys, yeah, this is pretty much it. I wanted to give you guys a little, um, this is pretty much it. I want to guys give you guys a little quick makeup routine using their products, show you on some melanin skin. Like, look at that highlighter. Look at it. You can see a little bit of blush right there. It's giving. And the fact that they are natural, very cruelty-free, vegan, I'm with that because I have very sensitive skin. So I am so with that. Like simple to the point, no extra, and we good. So if you guys like videos like this, definitely thumbs up this video. If you guys have ever tried out these products, let me know down below. If you are going to try these products out, let me know down below. And check, definitely check the description box because all the stuff that I use in the description box so you guys can try as well. I hope this video wasn't super long. I hope I went super fast and maybe gained some tips from what I do with my makeup. I don't know, but you can let me know your thoughts and opinions. And until next time, guys, kisses. Me to you. Bye.